I'm Adi Bitra, I'm from Israel, and I'm a metal musician. I'm the lead singer of Orpheus Blade, it's a prog metal band, and my solo project, Unred Dog, which is an electronic industrial metal project. Normally I'm more into metal and rock, but um, I am always interested in doing anything that's not uh, to push the boundaries, to search, to research. So it's not really about the genre, it's more about um, the storytelling. So this is an example of what I normally sing. In this Edo, when there is nothing but atrocious gloom, I'm the child of twilight and the aftertaste of sweat. We are punished for our sins of procreating new earth made of mad dreams. This is actually a mixture of things, and I think most uh, sounds in the metal, the modern metal uh, music today is a combination of things, of sounds, of colors, and this is how CVT really helped me in getting all these nuances. Um, so what I'm doing here in this phrase is actually combining some clean and distortion. So I'm aiming for distortion, but um, it's a little bit, my vocal folds are still doing the clean sounds. Um, and I am closing it up a little bit, I'm going a little reduced, so it sounds more compressed. So instead of going A, hey, it sounds like A, hey, like more held back. And from there I can go to complete distortion, pitchless, oh, this kind of sound, so it's just the noise. But if I'm going for a reduced sound and I'm darkening it up, so it would sound like more badass, uh, and then I can just play with the pitch, play with the volume, play with the openness, and then I can play around. Uh, first of all, I like to speak about clean vocals, um, because you know, everybody can scream, but to make this really, all these dynamics, it, it's like, there's aesthetics in it. I know it's, it's, it's funny to say that, but there's an aesthetics to it. So, um, and for each style in metal, it's very different. So uh, what I normally do is I teach about clean vocals, sounds, modes, and then I teach about color. And then we can talk about like uh, how to combine, how to put the effect on top. So you can imagine like you have a sound, you have color, you have pitch, you have volume, there it is, and now on top there goes the distortion, creaking, um, rattle, growl, whatever you want. Um, otherwise it would be just screaming. And um, if you want to go be more fe flexible with it, you need the whole picture. It's like, like a recipe of what you do. So if I want to go, for example, a more traditional heavy metal, I would do um, more in the direction of overdrive, somewhere here about sound color, like dark, but not very, very dark. And then I'd add some distortion mostly. So there I go like, hey, 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 and that's more of a heavy sound, heavy metal sound. Uh, if I want to go more, um, more of a pitchless direction, modern styling direction, I would take it more towards here, like reduced overdrive, uh, sometimes even curbing. I would go more dark, darker, and then I would add distortion, but I'd take off the pitch. So there I go like, oh, and reduced would be oh, and then oh, oh, and then oh. And this is um, the pitchless distortion kind of thing. With, with lots of attitude, this is important. You have to have lots of attitude. Uh, and then for the distortion, just think, uh, you have to keep the twang though. So I have to be a, a narrow, narrow um, vocal tract. So I'm going for, um, for like a pirate. Hey, hey, hey! And then I'm getting a bit annoyed. Hey! And there's my distortion, keeping it twangy at first. And after I master this, I would darken it up. So I go like, hey, 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 oh, oh, oh! And then it gets darker. Say your prayers, little one! And I have this kind of sound. <laughs> so basically for the more modern sound I would do, I would start the same, find my distortion, powered voice, yay, 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 darken it up, oh, oh, and then I would take the pitch off. And this is the place where it takes some time, but sometimes it really helps just to lower down the volume. So, oh, 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 oh. And now I'm raising a little bit uh, of my soft palette to get a reduced sound. And then it sounds more compressed, more here, and not shouty like it was before. So, A, A, O, 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 So, phrase, clean. Where anthropodes are baptized to die like the holy. And I'm gonna sing it distorted. Where anthropodes 
souls who are baptized today like the holy. To the institute, I already knew how to do the effects. I mean, I was a metal singer, I was playing live gigs and all, but I think what made it even better for me is understanding that we have a recipe, we have like all these uh, building blocks we can use and combine together, and then we can get different sounds, different um, frequencies, and then even my effects got so much more nuanced and so much more. Uh, powerful and I could use them in different ways that I couldn't before not because I worked on them but because I worked on all the rest so I think this is a great way to, uh, to perceive vocals and, and sound that you can it's like a path it's not um, boxes it's not like head voice chest voice it's like a path that you can use and you can pick different paths and combine them and then you can get this certain thing that you want and we can be so much more accurate in whatever we do even if we're doing clean or we're doing extreme vocals we can do so many things just by understanding how it works it's like divide and conquer <laughs>